you already know that ferrous and non-ferrous minerals are two types of metallic minerals. Why ferrous minerals contain iron? Non-ferrous minerals do not contain iron. Ferrous minerals constitute about 75% of the total production of minerals in India. The production is so large that India exports substantial amounts of ferrous minerals after meeting the domestic demand. Iron ore and manganese are two important ferrous minerals mined in India. From the spoon on your table to an artificial satellite orbiting the Earth in space, most of our industrial and scientific developments are made possible by a mineral called iron ore. Iron ore is a source of iron and steel and occurs in many forms. India has rich reserves of several good quality iron ores. The two main ores of iron are magnetite and hematite. Magnetite has higher iron content than hematite. Karnataka and Orissa are the main iron ore producing states in India, followed by Chhattisgarh and Jharkhand. If you map the location of major iron ore mines in India, you will see that they fall in four distinct regions. These regions, called major iron ore producing belts of India, are the Orissa Jharkhand belt, the Durg, Bastar, Chandrapur belt, the Bellari Chitradurga Chikmagalur Tumkur belt and the Maharashtra Goa belt. High grade hematite is mined in the Badam Pahad mines in Mayurbhanj and Kindurjar districts of Orissa. Hematite is also mined in Goa and Naumundi in Singhbhum district of Jharkhand. The Durg Bastar Chandrapur belt is spread over parts of Chhattisgarh and Maharashtra. You will find the famous Bailadila hills that look like the hump of an ox. These hills contain 14 deposits of hematite that is ideal for making steel. The produce from these mines is exported to Japan and South Korea via Vishakapatnam port. The Bellari Chitradurga Chikmagalur Tumkur belt lies in Karnataka. The Kudremuk mines in this region hold one of the largest deposits of iron ore in the world. Something very interesting happens here. The entire iron ore mined from Kudremukh is mixed with water to make slurry that is piped to a port near Mangalore for export. The Maharashtra Goa belt is spread over parts of Goa and Ratnagiri district of Maharashtra. The iron ore found here is not of very high grade. Yet, a substantial quantity is mined each year. Iron ore from the Maharashtra Goa belt is exported through Marmagaon port. Industrial iron and steel are both produced from iron ore. The advantage that steel offers over iron is its non-rusting property. Steel is a mixture of several minerals besides iron ore and one such important mineral is manganese. 
Besides being used in making steel, manganese is mixed with other metals to make alloys to produce food and drink cans. Manganese is also used in the manufacture of batteries, paints, and industrial chemicals like bleaching powder and insecticides. Orissa is the main manganese producing state in India, followed by Madhya Pradesh and Karnataka. Let us now move on to non-ferrous minerals. The reserves of non-ferrous minerals in India are not as abundant as those of ferrous minerals. Copper and bauxite are two important non-ferrous minerals mined in India. Being highly malleable, ductile, and excellent conductor of heat and electricity. Copper finds many applications. Copper is widely used in the electrical, electronic and chemical industries. Madhya Pradesh, Rajasthan and Jharkhand are the main copper producing states in India. The Balaghat mines in Madhya Pradesh, Khetri mines in Rajasthan and Singhbhum district of Jharkhand are the leading producer of copper. Our copper reserves, however, are not sufficient to meet our needs. Aluminium is a strong yet lightweight metal derived from a non-ferrous mineral. If you look into your school bag, Chances are, you will find some aluminium there. It may be in the form of your geometry box, your lunch box or the shiny foil in which your chapatis are rolled. Aluminium also finds use in making vehicles, paints, wires and cables doors and windows and much more. Bauxite is the main ore of aluminium. Bauxite deposits are left behind by the weathering of rocks rich in aluminium silicates. Oriza is the main bauxite producing state in India accounting for 34.97% of the country's total production followed by Gujarat, Jharkhand and Maharashtra. The Amar Kantak Plateau, the Mekal Hills, Bilaspur, Kakni and Panch Patmali in Koraput are the main regions where bauxite deposits are found in India. Did you know? Aluminium was so highly prized after its discovery that Napoleon Bonaparte wore buttons and hooks made from aluminium on his clothes. Aluminium vessels were used to serve food to the most important guests, while the others ate in gold or silver utensils. However, within 30 years, beggars on the streets of Paris were using aluminium bowls to collect arms. 